So today I'm talking about a P0352 code, what it is and how you go about fixing it. And so what is a P0352 code? Well, every cylinder inside the engine is going to have a coil that works with a spark plug to ignite the air fuel ratio mixture that goes into the cylinders. And when you get a P0352 code, the computer's seeing a problem with one of these, mainly with the ignition coil B. And ignition coil B is going to be the one on the number two cylinder. If it was ignition coil A, it would be number one. Ignition coil C would be number three. Ignition coil D would be number four and so on. So basically just go Google your engine and like firing order or cylinder location and look at Google images and find the number two cylinder. And that's going to be the cylinder that's having the problem. And so what are some possible causes of a P0352 code? Well, the first thing that could cause this is a bad ignition coil. It might have gone bad or something along these lines. You go take a look at it, be sure that it looks like it's okay, that there's no physical damage or anything like that. Sometimes oil can get on these and cause issues. Other times they can become cracked or different things like this. There's some different ways you go about testing these ignition coils to see if they have failed. One method is that you swap it out with another cylinder that's not having no problems. And if the problem follows, then you know that ignition coil is bad and you know it needs to be replaced. For example, if you swap Swap it out with cylinder number one and you clear the code and the code comes back but this time you get a p0351 or ignition coil a then you know that ignition coil is bad and it needs to be replaced like i said there's a different ways to go about testing those coils but the first thing that could cause this is a bad ignition coil the next thing that could cause this is the wiring going to the ignition coil if there's any kind of open or short or anything like this then it's going to cause the same symptoms as a bad coil to test the wires, you will need to get a schematic for your particular vehicle to know for sure what's going on inside the wiring. And then you can test it, be sure it's getting voltage, be sure it's got a good ground, different things like this. But the next thing that could cause this is that the wiring going to the coil is having some kind of issue. And the last thing on the list is going to be a bad spark plug. Usually when you have a P0352 code, it's going to be a bad coil or in the wiring. But that coil does work with that spark plug to ignite that air fuel mixture that's going into the cylinders. And so if that spark plug is bad, or there's some kind of issue going on with it, then it might be causing problems. So you can remove it, check it out, be sure it looks like it's good. But the last thing on the list is going to be a bad spark plug. And so that's basically it. I just want to give a basic overview of how you go about fixing a vehicle with the P0352 code. If you have anything to add, please comment down below. If you have any questions, ask me and I'll try to answer them. If this video helps you, please click like, please click subscribe and have a good day.